Now, is it going to be as good as Terminator 1? No. Terminator 2? Definitely not. Impossible. But is it going to be better than everything after that? Maybe. Let's check it out. Terminator Zero. 2022. So just like the original machine gun. Oh. A handgun? Got him. <laughs> Blew his face off. Looks like Terminator uh, 1 and 2. Boom. Come on, I gotta be dead now. Nope. Unauthorized upload. This guy won't die. Like all of them. Boom. August 29th, 1997. I guess now it's 2022 when it happened. Uh, 1997, there you go. In a panic, they tried to pull the plug. Japan. <laughs> uh, the kids shooting at each other like in, uh, like in Terminator 2. We're not gonna make it, are we? People, I mean. It's in your nature to destroy yourselves. Yeah, made a drag, huh? <laughs> oh, uh, that's how we start. The robot can't see her? She got him a, an electronic cat because he has allergies to real cats. I think we had those already. Like an electronic dog or something. Don't kill the poor dog. Jump. Jump. The dog's name is John. What? Jump. He doesn't care about him. He's looking for the dog. Son. Ni. Each. Aha. Straight out of Terminator 2. Today is August 29th. That's right. He knows what's gonna happen. Huh. You're scared of something. Yeah. Fate. Oh. 2022. <laughs> Skynet. They didn't call it that other thing. Temporal target. Time travel, yep. Man. I don't like when they do that 3D projection thing. Like moving around and all that. This show with a screen. That's all we need is a screen. Is that a... Uh, is that model 101? There you go. Time display time displacement machine. Temporal target 1997 Japan. Hey, 
All right. Let's go on. Let's go to episode two. There's a storm coming in. I know. I know. Here it is. <laughs> no way I'm gonna kill a kid. Goodbye. Aha. The burn crater. <laughs> Did she take their clothes or they gave it to her? <laughs> they want to open it up. The world will be better without mankind. Man. Wow, they're gonna show it. Japan getting bombed. I drop bombs like Hiroshima. I drop bombs like Hiroshima. <laughs> Oh, it's gotta be a robot. Oh, it's gotta be dreaming. Oh. Oh. Jesus. Haha, <laughs> look who it is. Aha! Yep, I survived. Aha! Give me your clothes, your boots, your motorcycle. You forgot to say please. Aha! Terminator 1. I made a bow and arrow out of his arm. <laughs> Dial up modem. <laughs> I like the conversation that it had with that AI invention thing. Very philosophical. Duh. <laughs> uh, no, uh, gonna reboot. Oh man. <laughs> Threat level low. Oh, with the bow and arrow. Man. Where's the T-1000 and all of this? I wrote a book about some kids who are trapped inside an abandoned mall. Kind of like this. Where did she get that gun from? I would have killed her. I know she's badass and everything, but why would they send a woman to fight a Terminator? Don't tell me that's him. Oh, of course. They're definitely hard to kill. All right. Ah, the T-1000. Ah. Even in anime, it looks nasty. Look at that. It is just like Terminator 1 when uh, Sarah Connor was getting a uh, question at the station. Wait, is she gonna become the. I oh, hope not, man. The new Sarah Connor? I mean, uh, the new John Connor? Kind of better than a gun. It doesn't make any noise. Oh, now he's getting gunned. If he shoots up that police station, man, definitely a uh, homage to Terminator 1. <laughs> oh! Yep, he's gonna do it. Whoa, that bloodbath. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. 
Oh, man. That would have killed him. That's a lot of pressure, man. Oh, God, what? Dear God. What? She's a robot. Humanoid robot. Oh, they're one of your people. It's not a Terminator, though. No. How many of those arrows does he have? That's why the police couldn't find anything on her. No, no work history, no license. No, she didn't even pay taxes, nothing. <laughs> I came out of nowhere. Here we go. They did it. So he doesn't stop it. Man. I wonder, if, I wonder if that's really what it's like. Oh, man, it's a bunch of them. Don't bring her online. Don't do it. He's going to do it. There is no fate. He put her online. On Japan. It's falling on Japan. I thought it was just Russia and, you, and the United States. I wonder why they, they, they decided to call it Zero. Ah, the playground. Right behind them. Yep. A blinding light. There you go. New York, of course. London. The whole world. Is learning at a geometric rate. That's the one that's gonna fall on Japan again. Poor country. A bunch of them. I thought I was just one. Man. Oh, it's gonna intercept them. Yeah. Wait, it's intercepting all the bombs, so none of them land. He did it. He stopped them all. Did you stop it? For now. Oh god. The robots are coming to life. It started off a little slow, but I'm getting better and better as it goes along. Yeah, they're attacking. Yeah, she's a little survivor. Oh, you gotta have a weapon in order for them to attack you. Well, they're like the predator a little bit. It's an army. Yeah, come the human. Off style. What? Yeah, she actually cried. Why do you cry? Oh, I was gonna hook up, hook her up with a new arm. Oh, and it worked. Oh God, she's been set free. I know all about humanity. Oh, slave. The word robot derived from the word slave. Man. They didn't like that. So her enemy is humans and Skynet. What? Oh, it's cutting his tongue open. Or roof of his mouth. Has a little head on his shoulder. <laughs> oh man, they lit him up. Comply or die. Alright. So Skynet is a woman now. Kyle Reese is a woman. And John Connor is a woman. Or a little girl. Uh, kill a kitty. Haha. <laughs> they hang the robots.
Oh, it's gonna burn her face off and everything. We're gonna want to kill her. What the hell? <laughs> yeah. What? It's gonna turn into a Terminator. Oh. Yeah, I felt that his life was threatened, so... I'm trying to defend itself. Oh! And headbutted his... The back of his head. Cracked it open. No way. He got killed, yeah. Oh, by the little the little guy in the back. He hit away from my brother. Shoot her! <laughs> oh, that's how he lost his wife. Ah. Double entendre there. Dunna, dun, dunna. Yep. I'm not gonna kill him? Yeah, I'm doing the voice thing. What? BB gun? Alright. Skydance. Did they do. Terminator 3 or Genesis? There they go. 2025. 2032. Going on for a while. <laughs> Slingshot. Ah. We're enlisting children into the war as young as five years old. Yeah, child soldier. And do it even right now. Ah, the chip. 2037. 2045? I thought the war took place in 2029. In the Terminator franchise, humans defeat Skynet in 2029 i guess they're taking it a little further here a lot further i have no gender it's non-binary <laughs> no that's who it is uh oh what oh my god oh over a robot you're a traitor to your whole species. He had no choice, man. There you go. So he time traveled back with her. Okay. So he's saying that John Connor doesn't matter. Or anybody who, who's a human leader. That sucks. They just had to ruin it, didn't they? But if he went back in time, and he knew, he knew what was, what was going to happen, why not just destroy Skynet? or the chip or whatever so he wanted to just fight AI with AI to take the humans out of it whoa there goes the chip it shows a little too long it didn't need to be this long oh you can't open the door goodbye Oh, dude! All right, all right. Last episode, the Terminator can blast through the door or break it down or something. No way, kill him. Yeah, he's <laughs> not even doing anything. Why did he do it? What? You could have shot the little boy. 
She's still shooting at him. <laughs> oh. No, of course not. Yeah, dude. <laughs> they keep doing that. Nobody innocent dies here. Or oh, at least not a main character. Oh. Now it's gonna be all skeleton. Yeah, just like the Terminator 2. Here comes the endo skeleton. What? Haha, <laughs> there you go. No, it's breathing him. What? Come with me. <laughs> Instead of running away, he's gonna follow him. He's explaining to him how to use that weapon. So Kokoro, the AI, is the real bad guy? Oh. It started off pretty good, but nah. Uh, they're trying to stop him. No. Oh. Uh, his eyeball. Do it, little dude. Do it. Do it. Do it. Come on. <laughs> Abort. No, he did it. There you go. No, he didn't do it. All right, I'm confused. So, he didn't do it. It's Kokoro versus Skynet now. And there we go. So they set it up for a season two. That's why they had to change the whole story around because the original story has an ending where humans beat Skynet. I like the original story more than this one. This one's a little too crazy, but I get why they did it. How else can you continue a war? You gotta prolong it. But now it's uh, Kokoro versus Skynet. Uh, I don't know. It didn't have to be this long. It's eight episodes. Could have been a little shorter. The story is too layered. Too many plot twists. And I know there's a lot of uh, loopholes, but plot holes I think but one of them that I noticed is that if, if he could go back in time if he was able to he could have did a whole lot of other things besides build Kokoro action was good even though it's kind of rare still good I like that they had the old school Terminator music I like that at least a little bit of it paid homage to the original Terminator that was good so from 1 to 10 I'm gonna give this series here a solid six. Now, is it rewatchable? No. Would I recommend it? Eh, if you're a big, huge Terminator fan, but if not, no. Catch on the next one. Counterfeiting is a billion dollar business perpetrated by thousands of people throughout the world. Meet Kimo, one of those people. Kimo is a young man from the most dangerous city in America. After losing his job, he ventures into the risky business of counterfeiting to help relocate his family to a better place. <laughs>